right, welcome back to On the Warpath. Sanchez 405 with you. Continuing the coverage of the NFL Draft and the Washington Commanders, they pull off probably the biggest steal. You got to play your cards right. But the biggest steal in the NFL Draft, they take. Sam Howell, quarterback out of UNC, a guy who was projected to go in the first round, maybe the second round, tumbles all the way down to the second round of day three. And you go out and you draft him. The offer you could not refuse. He was staring you. It's like that twitchy light bulb. It was just staring you, wanting to be changed, or you needed to twist it in a little bit more. You look at Sam Howell. Uh, the guy's got a great deep ball accuracy. He's not afraid. He will step up. He will run on his own. Over 800 yards rushing, 11 touchdowns on the ground, 3,000 yards. He was the only qu quarterback in college football to do that. He set so many passing records, uh, so many individual records at UNC. Passing yards, total touchdowns, rushing, uh, excuse me, passing touchdowns. And he even has the single season record, which he did set as a true freshman, 38 touchdown passes, which is a school record. Very impressive. A uh, great pedigree uh, for this kid. Also, he, he threw a touchdown in every one of his games as a Tar Heel. That's that's even more impressive. Uh, you know, I, I think this is a guy that he, he can sit there. He does not have to be thrown to the Wolves on day one. It's why you traded for Carson Wentz. It's why you still have Taylor Heineke on your roster. You've got a guy who can sit in the room with Kim Zampezi, with uh, Scott Turner, and learn. Hold that clipboard. Learn it. Put the little headpiece in. Learn it. Take those mental reps. This, how can you not Love this pick. I know some people say, well, maybe Carson Strong. He does not have, hey, he, he doesn't have the knee history like Carson Strong has. Not knocking him on that. He's drawn comparisons to a slower version of Russell Wilson. Has um, Sam Howell, the pro football focus. Uh, also, he, he they said Chase Daniel, journeyman uh, backup uh, in the league. A guy that, Washington had at one time. But uh, you look at this. I, I mean, Sam Howe. If you had have told me this at the beginning of the draft, Washington would take him on day three, I would have looked at you and said you were crazy. Some people might not have thought that. But still, this, I love this pick. I've said I liked a lot of the picks. I love this pick. Excellent. Muy caliente. Hot value. Great value. Come on, y'all. This is a good one. And now he can sit, grow, develop, mature. And then maybe, maybe eventually we get to see him. We get to see, we may get to see Sam Howe there. Uh, you know, it, it, some people have even drawn, like, physically wise to a Drew Brees. So maybe if we can get that out of him, hey, come on now. It's win win. But y'all, tell me what you're thinking. Do you like the Sam Howe pickup? Uh, do you wish we could have got somebody else there? I love, love, love this pick from the Tar Heels. We have Commander Sam. How do you do how? Because how well did Washington do with this pick? Give me a grade in the comments, y'all. As always, appreciate everything you're doing to help this channel grow. I love you guys. As always, keep that same damn energy. We'll outlast the bastards together, and a new commander is in the fold. St. Charles 405, don't give up until the miracle happens. I am out. Love, peace, and hell.